Hey y'all, what is good? It is your girl T-I-G-G-Y and I am back with another video today. So in this video, I'm going to teach you guys how to create a KWGT widget, but more specifically a music widget. This was a requested video and I said I would get this done for you guys. Um, it can be fairly easy, but sometimes just with all the... Um, like commands that they have in there you guys if you see my previous video you know what i'm talking about um did all the different codes i'm sorry um it can be seen very confusing so i'm just going to kind of give you guys the simple this way that i like to do them um if you go into the play store and you search kwgt music um and just hit enter it'll actually give you some pre-made widgets now of course you guys you can customize these widgets so i'll definitely get into that with you guys but i do like to use these to get the base down why because your girl is too impatient to be looking for a pause button and all of that i just load up a widget and customize it from there so what you're going to do is and i'll have those two linked down in the description you're going to go into your edit mode on total launcher or if you're using the samsung home screen or any other launcher just go into adding a widget you're going to do plus widget you're going to hit widget again and we're going to look for the KWGT. And I'm going to do a 4x1. And then tap away from it so that the little green box isn't there. And then we're going to hit on that area. And then let's go back. When you tap on it, this will usually come up for you guys, okay? So you can either make your own but that's not what i'm showing you guys today i'm showing you how to change the preset one so i do like this one so then what you do is you click on here and we can do we're going to change the color to pink and the writing i am going to make let's see how this blue looks We'll make black. This gives you the different layers. And I like to size it bigger because I want it to be pretty big. Then this is the touch area. Okay, so you can go to touch and you can hit the plus sign and then so we'll tap on here because it'll say single so you hit single you hit on that and it says action none and you're going to tap on this and this is where we're going to get into it so you're going to hit music controls this is the play pause button so a single click on the play button will play and pause it all right then we're going to hit plus again tap on it action music controls we're going to hit on the play pause because we need to change that and we're going to change it to previous okay now if you click on one click on the previous button we'll take it back to the previous then we're going to hit plus again none action music controls play pause and we're going to hit next so now your music controls will actually work. So you have the play pause button, the rewind, and the fast forward. Now what you can do is hit plus and tap on here. And hit action. And we're going to say launch app. So this is where you can set the app that if you click on it, what app does this music widget launch okay i personally use spotify so i'm going to look for spotify and click on this then i can go back and you can also change the background okay so when i go back to cancel when i go back to the very beginning and it says the items background and you can you cannot no longer see all the different areas you only see one thing and it just says music you can hit on background and you can change this okay and you can add like a cute little background back there so let's 
Let's see. Mm, we'll go on Google. So what I like to do is I was helping someone look for some Christmas themes. Hi, boo. I know you're probably going to watch this. <laughs> so you're going to go to Google. And when you go to Google, you can look up like, um, we'll look up rounded... rectangle transparent and we'll hit images and I'm basically going to try to find a really cute background and maybe I don't know if this is actually transparent usually when they have the preview and you can already see like the little checker background usually it's not transparent um let's see if there's anything else we'll do We'll do chat bubble. And I'm just trying to see if I can find one because I think that would be really cute, a little chat bubble. Let's see, uh, ooh, here we go. So what I'm going to try to do is we'll leave it like this and I'm going to hit save and it should be on my screen now. So if I press and hold background image plus because this is a gift guys and if I and look how it moves now. What we need to do is see if I can make that background bigger or what I'll do is we'll make the widget smaller so that it can fit inside of that chat bubble. This one's it right here. We will click. And I'm going to hit save. Let's see how that looks. Why? Because as y'all can see, I can make it bigger or smaller anyway. Then we're going to go back to the background. And tap on this and we'll see how that looks 
there we go. So that is how you can make a cute one. And as you guys can see, you can add gifts to the background of them. You would just have to do exactly what I did, which is I made my widget and then I went, I'm using Total Launcher. Keep that in mind too. If you're not using Total Launcher, um, you can't add, or if you, you have to use some type of launcher, but like Samsung default, you won't be able to do what I did, which was like go back and add that like little cute, um, gift background. You won't be able to do that. So keep that in mind and as you can see it seems a little like off centered you can always delete go back to widget we'll hit four by one go back Go to this one and we are going to look for position. I might need to, there we go. And hit save. And we'll see how that now looks because I want to go back and add that image. This is like a, you have to keep trying until you kind of get it right. And there we go for me. Now I can always tap on this. And there we go. So then... If I hit play, if I go in, remember, single click will give me a Spotify. Whatever you do have playing, if you click on it, it'll go back or play and pause. So as you guys can see, it actually does work when you add those actions in there. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope it was informative. If you do have any questions or um you feel like you don't quite understand, just drop a comment. Don't forget to have a good night, a good evening, a good day, a good morning, wherever you are in the world. And until next time.